It's all coming up, but we're going to begin at this 5 o'clock hour with breaking news. A gun battle in Inkster leads to a car hitting a house. Yes, it does, and let's get right to our Mara McDonald. She's live at the scene, and Mara, what can you tell us? Carmen, let me set it up for you. First of all, take a look behind me. You can see they have got Cherry Hill between Merriman and Millibelt completely blocked off. Massive police presence out here. All of these are police vehicles. Now, let me get out of the shot so you can see. Do you see that Kia Optima over there? That car was involved in what police are telling us was a gun battle down Cherry Hill. You had two cars that were shooting at each other. The person who was driving that Kia was shot. The car jumped the curb, hit the house. Witnesses are telling us that they saw ambulance, uh, EMS people, police, haul the person out of that car, try and admit or administer CPR. That person's been taken to the hospital. They tell us it was a man unclear on whether he has survived this. Witnesses tell us they could hear the gunshots in their homes. We heard it come off our house, and it, it must have been like 10 shots. And it, so it came down, and it hit, like, it sounded like it hit our house, but we don't know. Back here live, police are telling us that they are not clear whether this was some sort of a road rage thing or whether these two cars full of people knew each other. But take a quick walk with me. Do you see the squad cars over here by these apartments? There's been an, uh, an increased police presence in those apartments. They're clearly looking for somebody. Police telling us right now that they do not have anybody in custody. They are looking for the other car that was involved and the other people that were involved. And right now, no condition on the man that was taken out of that car that jumped the curb and hit that home. So we are live in Inkster right now. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Okay, Mara, now to 